Hey everyone. So I thought I'd jump in the fun and do a video response for Rick over at Vintage Oddball Cards. He and I have uh, some similar collecting tastes and I think he's going to appreciate the cards I'm about to show. First, from the very rare, very rare set. Um, now these are listed in different years, 1907, 1909. I believe they're from 1910 because there's a Harry Kovaleski in this set that shows him in a Cincinnati Reds uh, uniform or playing for the Reds and he only played for them one year and that was 1910. And that is the W555 Honus Wagner. These were cut off of boxes that had, I guess, um, toys in them and jewelry and I think maybe some candies. And they were little cutouts uh, on the side of the boxes. And this, I believe it's from, um, I believe it's from 1914, I believe. And this is a rare card that you've seen this image maybe on other cards that were later on. Um, but this is a Cuban card. And it features Tris Speaker. I'm pretty sure this is the first issue that showed this image. And this is a rare set, Bruner's Bread, and this is Nap Lajaway. And another very rare set, and they just did a feature uh, on this in either Beckett Vintage, I think it was Beckett Vintage, on uh, somebody that had the Babe Adams in this set and how rare that was. I think it's the possibly the only one known. And um, this is also very rare. And I'm a Pittsburgh Pirates fan, so this was the first one I got. And that's a 1910 orange border um, Pittsburgh Pirates team card featuring them as the national champions. And of course, um, that's one of the greatest baseball teams in history. It's regarded as one of them. Along with the 1927 Yankees and others. And of course, I've shown my Ty Cobb and uh, Dave over at Blue Jacket uh, 66 has a beautiful uh, Ty Cobb in this set as well. It's a very rare card. And have this little cutout, and it's a beautiful card. Um, another very rare set of Walter Johnson. So Rick, congratulations on your subs. I hope you enjoyed these cards. Uh, I'm, I'm pretty sure you would. Thanks for watching.